When President Putin launched his full-scale invasion two years ago, he wanted less NATO and more control over his neighbors. He wanted to destroy Ukraine as a sovereign state. But he failed. NATO is bigger and stronger. Ukraine is closer to NATO membership than ever before. And as the brave Ukrainian continues to fight for the freedom, we stand by their side. President Putin started this war, and he could end it today. But Ukraine does not have this option. Surrender is not peace. We must continue to strengthen Ukraine, to show President Putin that he will not get what he wants on the battlefield, but must sit down and negotiate a solution where Ukraine is recognized and prevails as a sovereign independent nation. The security situation in our region has not been this serious since the Second World War, and Russia will stay a threat to Euro-Atlantic security for a foreseeable future. It was in this light Sweden applied to join the NATO Defence Alliance to gain security, but also to provide security.